welcome back to my channel my name is Tony for those who don't know and basically everything here is about motherhood lifestyle and home decor um so just sharing bits and things of you know just me and my everyday um today's video will be a part of vlogmas so I'm super excited to get this video out um but it will be short and sweet um a diaper bag or what's my diaper bag video so here is my diaper bag um I currently have a eight month year old as of yesterday um so yeah she's eight months old so this is basically been kind of like the standard um what I put in her bag um since she's been born nothing has really changed significantly um so yeah I will definitely share um I have the Lulu baby um diaper bag and so it is a backpack and it has this top handle um, I will probably do like a separate video for a full review on the diaper bag um, because again today's video will be more so about what's in my bag um, but I will say I do pretty much like this bag um, for the most part and I've been using it again um, for the last eight months so let's see what we got so typically this bag um, I try to keep it packed with like the basic stuff um that we need every day um you know just kind of have it ready so i'm not always scrambling when i get out the house but if you're a mom you pretty much know nine times out of ten you're scrambling um but i try to try my best to just keep everything in it um to make it easiest for me so again this is a diaper bag um it's very spacious so the first item that is typically on top is a blanket. Um, again, especially it's winter time. So probably once we enter the summer months, I may not need this as much. But of course, I just always have a blanket handy in case it's cold somewhere. And I usually just drape this over her stroller. So it's always just, you know, sitting there right on top. Um, easy for me to grab. Next, I have a cooler bag. Um, to keep her bottles and breast milk in. Of course, it's empty right now because I'm not going anywhere. But this is a nice size bag um, for bottles and to, you know, just fit nicely into her diaper bag. And of course, it has an ice pack inside. And again, her bottles typically go in here um, with her milk. Um, in my little side pockets, I typically keep... Just some little fun toys that she likes. Um, these usually change out, of course, depending on what she's been feeling. But, like, this is a little book that makes noise that she loves. A teething toy and another, like, rattle. Um, I find the rattle to be very useful, mainly when we're out. If I have her in the stroller and she gets fussy, usually I can get this going a little bit and it keeps her a little occupied. Um, and of course I have a bottle. This is an empty bottle in here that would typically be in that cooler pack. Um, also I have these. So these are diaper bags, which was gifted to me. Not something that I typically would have thought of, but they have been like essential. If you're out and you have like a blowout or a massive diaper and you want to contain it, you have these bags. They're like not to compare you know to a dog or anything but I have a dog so that's where my mind goes to um they're just basically like little poop bags um but for the diaper of course so yes this is I and I need to refill these but um yeah th this has been very helpful while we're out we don't have access to a trash can or um you know whatever just something very convenient to have and tie her tie her diapers up in um, I always have an extra pair of socks because babies like to lose their socks, um, especially my child. It's like, um, but yeah, so an extra pair of socks is definitely always helpful to have on hand. Again, we are in the winter month, so I don't want her feet to be cold or exposed more than they should be. Uh, of course, I have wipes. I use water wipes and diapers. Um, don't have any diapers in here at the moment shame on me um, but usually I keep it stocked with at least like eight diapers at a time and I could very well fit probably more than that but you know just enough to at least get me through a, a full day if needed be um, extra outfits 
So right now I just have two shirts and pants in here. Um, again, just something chill, nothing that I will miss like from her wardrobe, but something that's just very basic in case she's in need of an outfit change. Um, bibs, she goes through several bibs at a time or at a, in a day. So I currently have four bibs in here. And I really love these bibs. I'll see if I can link the brand. But these are like muslin bibs. I think I got these ones from Target. But I just love the quality of these. So those are actually one of my favorite bibs. And I have grown to love these copper pearl bibs. They weren't great when she was a newborn. I just felt like they were too big. But now that she's a little older, I am using them more. And I do find that I like them. So, And these are the bandana style bib so super cute so always have those handy um i also keep burp cloths again because again i don't know about y'all kids or your soon-to-be kid um but burp cloths are definitely always nice to have on hand as well this is just like a little muslim blanket just for an extra whatever um <laughs> also have a changing mat in here so I have the gate three changing mat um I do like this and I used it a lot more when she was a newborn um like well I guess I'll use it more like in the house but now I don't use it as much but definitely great um for when we're out it's wipeable um it's pretty you know sturdy it looks good um, so yeah, so I will recommend this changing mat um, if you want a more luxe, I guess, changing mat. Otherwise, anything will do. And I also have a wet and dry bag. So basically, if she soils any of her clothes or any of her wet bibs, sometimes, not always, but it's nice to have one of these to keep them separate from anything that's clean or just, you know, so you know that those items need to be washed. So have all of this stuff just kind of tucked in here nicely sometimes nicely it does get kind of crazy in this bag um i also have her little book um for her doctor's office that keeps like all of her updates in and that's again just helpful to keep in here for when we go to the doctor's office it's, i just know that it's already in there um and i don't have to you know repack it every time we go um I don't have it in here now so I just left out with her but as you can see this has a front pocket so typically um like if I'm going out to make things easier like I don't even really carry a purse that often anymore um especially if it's just me and her going out so this pocket is big enough for me to put in my wallet like lip gloss and my phone like just like the basic stuff so yeah that is really all that's in my diaper bag um and again i have these side pockets here um that are also helpful but they usually typically stay empty unless i have like a bottle ready um, for her but other than that yeah so that is what's in my lulu baby diaper bag um you know all of kind of the basic essential stuff and anything else that i need you know for that particular day or event i usually have enough room to add that in but yeah so hopefully this video was helpful i told you all it would be short and sweet um again but if you just needed some tips or ideas on what to put in your diaper bag or what expect what you should expect to put in your diaper bag hopefully this was helpful so again thank you all for watching um and again, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Feel free to follow me on Instagram. And stay tuned for more mom content and more home decor content and more lifestyle content. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.